Good evening, everyone. More on the threat for severe weather tonight and tomorrow in just a moment. But first, we need to begin and continue our coverage of the breaking news in Harvest. A deadly helicopter crash has a major road shut down right now. WAFO 48 Sean Dowling joins us now. Sean, we have learned some new details about this horrific accident in the last few minutes. Yes, Liz, we have. We now know uh, because of credible sources telling WAFF 48 News that the chopper belonged to the Tennessee National Guard. And right now, the military is in the process of contacting the victims' families. NBC is reporting that two people died. Now, as you know, it all happened near a busy highway, and multiple people witnessed the crash. The Black Hawk burst into flames upon impact. Like I mentioned, two people are dead, but it's unclear how many people were on board. Aaliyah is taking over the investigation. And the Madison County Sheriff's Office is blocking off a large stretch of road, not far from Sparkman High School, Highway 53, and the intersection of Burwell Road. And even though we've been moved to a nearby water treatment plant, you can still see it's a very active scene behind me all these hours later. And right now, the Madison County Sheriff's Office is still blocking off a very large stretch of road, and they expect it to be closed for quite some time tonight. Our own 48 uh, Romario Gardner reporter is gathering more information for a report tonight coming up at 10. Right now, reporting live in Harvest, I'm Sean Dowling. 48 on your side. Thank you, Sean. New video just into our newsroom shows the moment that Black Hawk helicopter came crashing down, literally in the middle of that busy intersection. Take a look at the upper right hand corner of your screen. You'll see the helicopter literally dropping out of the sky uncontrollably. Moments later, you'll see heavy black smoke billowing from that crash site. All of this captured on a doorbell camera from a home in a nearby subdivision. These images will no doubt help investigators piece together what happened in this tragedy. Many of you.